Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about one step equations, and we're going to solve each equation. So, if I was given this equation, 15 plus b equals 23. Well, I have 15 plus b equals 23, and I need to get the letter b by itself. Well, to do that, I need to bring the 15 over to the right hand side. Well, how do I do that? Well, there's a plus 15, it's a positive 15, and I'm adding these two numbers together. Okay. If we use the commutative property, I could rearrange this to be b plus 15, positive 15, right, equals 23. That makes it a little easier to see that I, all I have to do is subtract a 15 to both sides, opposite of addition. Subtract a 15, subtract a 15, and so now we're left with, well, b just comes down, 15 minus 15 is 0, and now I have 23 minus 15. Well, how do I solve that? Let's use the, um, the traditional method. The 3 minus 5 can't do that. 2 becomes a 1, 13. Now I'm left with 13 minus 5. 13 minus 5 comes out to be an 8. And now 1 minus 1 is 0. And so now we're left with a final answer here of 8. Well, b plus 0 equals 8. Don't need to add 0. So now we're left with b equals 8 as our final answer. So let's recap here. We're, we're started with 15 plus b equals 23. I use the commutative property to rearrange it to be b plus 15 equals 23. I then subtracted 15 to both sides. Now, you might be quick and can run 23 minus 15 to get 8, and that's fine. I used the traditional method, still got there to be 8. So now we're left with b plus 0 equals 8. Well, adding 0 doesn't change anything, so we're left with just b equals 8 as our final answer. 